What is going on people? My name is Swick and welcome back to a brand new video today where I'm going to be doing a very special video on the brand new MW4. Now if you don't know what MW4 is or when it is coming out, uh, there is no exact release date for this MW4 yet but there is a confirmation that it will be MW4 and unfortunately personally I did want a Black Ops 3 but there is the MW4. Now, now, if you followed the story from MW3, MW2, and also COD4, um, there was a so story including Captain Price and Soap and stuff like that, that is actually carrying on in the new MW4. Now, there was some main characters uh, like Captain Price that have uh, actually unfortunately died in these uh, this story and Soap. Now, I'll get to that in further news, but first, I actually want to tell you guys about the new leading character in MW4. MW4. The lead character is codenamed Ben Burke. Now, Ben Burke could be anyone. It could literally be anyone. But this is quite special because um, I've actually got some pictures on the screen now of this Ben Burke, and this uh, this guy could be anyone. Um, it could it, it, it could be it could be someone from you know call of duty 4 mw2 mw3 someone that was really special but the most special news that i've literally got back in is john mctavish is returning if you who the hell is john mctavish um it is soap soap is one of the main characters in uh, i think it was uh cod um was it mw3 i don't know mw3 something like that he will be returning um, in MW4 for the missions now what the hell how the hell is Soap returning he died uh, in the Somalia mission um, um, yes he did he did die but the thing is there is going to be a flashback mission now this could be anything but my theory is that there is a flashback flashback mission where you save Soap this could be this is my theory on it but I think that could be what happens a flat flashback mission where you go in and you save soap with this new leading character code named ben burke now this could be anyone like i say it could be even soap my theory could be completely wrong but i think that it could be right Okay, so a small proportion of the game script has also been leaked by the same source who has released the information about True Crime Hong Kong, Sleeping Dogs. Now, if you don't know what Sleeping Dogs is, it's basically like GTA, but a Chinese version. Um, so it's it was pretty fun, but uh, so also, but I think the screenwriting um, information is also related to the new MW4 that is coming up soon. And, um, like I say, uh, Bill Murray is returning for the voiceover of Captain Price. Now, if, um, that, yeah, if you don't know who Bill Murray is, he's a legendary actor of Ghostbusters. And he did actually the voiceover for Captain Price back in MW4, uh, MW4, COD4. Um, that was very, very good. So, he is returning. But the main thing is, another theory is captain price coming back now captain price died uh, he did die but uh, it could be it could be anything everything could be mixed up um and yeah so the news of an mw4 follow-up appeared on the same week that black ops 2 was released for the xbox 360 ps3 and pc yes uh, this information was actually released on the same week that black ops 2 was released last year now um call of duty mw4 could come out any time in 2014 yes i do say 2014 because there is a confirmation that this year mw4 will be coming out now there is an also a sort of like co um sort of like thing that's happening here if you look cod 4 was the sort of like first um that came on the scene for like cods and the cod community and then it you know it came up and then it started going mw and then it black ops and then it started going mw and then it started you know so it's sort of like you know mw4 and then is there going to be a Black Ops 3 after MW4? It could be 
anything. It could literally be anything. But this is the confirmation news of the new MW4 that Sledgehammer are going to be producing the new MW4 game, which is absolutely amazing that Sledgehammer are actually doing this um, because I love to see new um, new companies on the scene pr uh, producing the games uh, because you guys are like, what the hell? We don't like to see new producers on the scene making the games. But think, look when we first saw Treyarch into the scene and we got Black Ops 2, we were absolutely amazed. It's one of the best get Call of Duty is for me personally that's ever come out now if it isn't for you please leave down in the comments below because I would like to know and if you would like more leaked information on the new MW4 please leave down in the comments below smash that like button if you like the video and if you're new please make sure to subscribe anyway guys see you guys later have a good day and goodbye